Hello everyone. Today I'm going to make a real short video uh, about how to use theodolite to measure uh, angles of a slope. And uh, this is very commonly used when you're studying avalanche conditions out west and you know you want to know uh, the avalanche risk and, and a big part of that equation is to know the slope angle and of course you need to know about the slope composition and weather conditions and things like that but slope angle is one of the big things that you need to know. Now there's two ways to make this measurement with theodolite. One of them would be to look uh, at a side slope angle as you see in the camera view here and then another one would be to look downhill or you could be looking uphill but in this case I'll be looking downhill and you'll measure the angle that way as well. Now uh, I happen to be in Virginia at Wintergreen Resort. Very low avalanche risk here. In fact I'm skiing super hard and fast uh, groomed packed powder and uh, uh, you, you won't typically be measuring slope angles out here but the procedure is the same no matter where you are and so uh, we'll show a few short clips next that illustrate the two types of measurements you can do. Okay, so this first measurement, I'm on uh, looking at the side of the slope. And so I'm, for this, I'm going to read the angle on the left side of the screen. And for, for what I'm seeing now, this is about a 21 degree slope as viewed from the side. Okay, now I'm going to look down slope and read the angle. And I'm going to aim it to be parallel to the slope. And now I'm going to read the angle on the right side of the screen. And again, I'm getting about 21, 22 degrees uh, from this view. Okay, well, I hope that was useful. Those are two ways you can use theodolite to measure slope angles. And uh, have fun skiing and, and stay safe out there.